is Arvind Raj Bodh. I am a Buddhist person. First, I give Salaam Alaikum to all the Muslim brothers and the, all the uh, Muslim sisters. Thank you. Here I heard a lot of teaching from our Malaysian brothers. I hear that our brother said there is some disagree feelings between the Jews and the Islam, the Christianity and the Islam. I give lot of thanks that he did not uh, joined us in that queue because we are the Buddhist people the history is witness that since 2500 years there was no controversy between Islam and Buddhism here I hear the teaching of our Malaysian brother he said the Almighty or the God he know everything from beginning to uh, 11 September he know everything from beginning to 11 September and he did not stop or say what that I need the reason is that your only question about this in this hall I prepared only for this only thank you it's a good question from the brother because I did mention in my talk that Allah the all-knowing the Creator he knows everything that's going to happen from the early day of the creation of things until the end and also he know what is going to happen in 9-11 is that what you're trying to ask me just now yes okay good. you said that he know everything and you are asking me now why he don't stop it and I reason I need the uh, yes. reason he, why he did not stop in the or he allow more like this Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran say I'm going to say what Allah said in the Quran Zahra fasad fil barri wal bahri bima qasabat aydin nas it's not what I say Allah tell us he said that this earth they have peace but later on there's a lot of destruction the destruction on this earth is because of human hand it's not because of God he allowed it to happen why because if you want to create destruction among yourself you go I give you the freedom to choose I give you the right to act in anything you want to do you want to do good thing you can do you want to do bad thing also I'm not going to stop you that's why we are different than other creation we are human Allah give you the freedom to think the freedom to act but you must take responsibility in whatever you do so what is happening there also is part what Allah have allowed it to happen because you want to do it he didn't call you to do that Allah tells say you go and bomb this and destroy this being I need this mic here. Yeah. yeah? Yes. So now what I'm telling you that what happened, he knows. He didn't stop because you want to do it. He let you do it. But I am in his control. But then I am in his, his okay. control. Okay. You're in his control, of course. But he gives you the freedom. He give you he don't create the Or he problem. give me freedom to destroy? If you want to destroy, yes. But I am in his control. Yes. He gave you the right. Now if you say that you are under his control totally, that he didn't give you the right to act, then you cannot do anything. Now you're doing a lot of things. Do you know that what you do is with his permission or not? When he's he, happy, he's happy of what you want to do. When he control me, how can I take permission from him? No, oh, yes. There is a difference between human and other creation. We are the best creation. And when he created us, he did not want to create us as a puppet. 
like a robot. No, no, he didn't create us like that because we are special creation. Special creation. Special creation, and he gives you the freedom to act, and he tell you, don't do this, don't do that. If you do this, you do that.